some time ago I have published two tools relying on offline SAM and offline LSA uh, DLLs being included in every single Windows 10 operating systems. Those, to those tools are open source, though, uh, those tools are provided on my GitHub. Uh, you can play with them. They are adding uh, some uh, attributes or just adding new accounts to the SAM database of uh, system being turned off. Right now I have created a new tool, the um, offline uh, SAM tool. This tool is a fully blown editor with some graphical interface uh, allowing you to um, edit uh, the SAM database, every single aspect of the SAM database. So you can see uh, groups uh, in your SAM database on the machine which is turned off. You can see uh, accounts being present here. You can create a new account. Let's uh, call it my admin. Uh, if you set uh, this user, uh, you have all parameters which are present in the SAM database exposed here. So you can say uh, which privileges uh, belong to this uh, account. Uh, the account is by default disabled, so you can enable it uh, leaving normal account you can set the uh, password uh, let's say it is password you can save it and the account is created and ready to use if you go to administrators group you can uh, add my admin account here to be an uh, admin so that's basically uh, it you can also add some uh, privileges to groups, uh, you can set uh, comments, uh, yes, save, uh, comments, you can hide it from UAE, set or remove all UAC flags and so on. And um, the tool itself is uh, done. If I restart my machine, uh, jumping off Windows PE, my Windows uh, 10 boots up. And I believe my my admin account with the password password uh, will be allowed to log on and it will belong to administrators uh, group as set here. So uh, the tool itself is slightly better than the um, tools I uh, published previously because um, for this particular tool uh, you have a chance to set every single bit being exposed by the SAM uh, database. Um, I will log on here as uh, my admin uh, with the password, password freshly set and uh, as you can see uh, the logon is uh, successful. So you can also play on your own. You cannot address your online Windows uh, system, the working one. But if you have a folder with Windows, you can reach it from mounted uh, virtual hard drive. You can reach it uh, from another drive, uh, from the USB stick, uh, or you can boot from ISO for USB stick, etc. and edit the system which is turned uh, off.